Prior to all the song and dance, the McEwen University's Har Theatre is bustling as 30 theatre production students work tirelessly to bring the magic to the stage. Between the props department, carpentry, paint, uh, wardrobe is in, and eventually lighting and sound, stage management, they're always on too. A two-year program, theatre production manages to create everything from elaborate lighting to colourful sets. With such a unique program, Lewis McCallum knew that this would be the perfect place for him. When we visited, Lewis was busy building props for McEwen's upcoming production of Curtains. With the production taking place in 1959 Boston, the crew has been busy with research in order to create authentic pieces. Research is one part and can be tedious, but interesting. It's like any research. It, can take hours to find the right thing or just nothing at all to do with what you're looking for. Across the theatre is Carly Christie who's busy working as the head painter. Basically a uh, person who's in charge of the ov overall um, outcome of what the set designer wanted. Creating a unique experience since Carly and fellow paint students have been given the rare opportunity to work on a drop. We have three drops and we have as a head painter you mix up the right colors that the designer wanted and you help organize your crew so you organize them. Not a common experience since many theaters don't even have drops, never mind one of this caliber and size. That's just one of the reasons why Darcy fell in love with this program and decided to remain and be part of the faculty. The program changed my life and in, in some instances probably saved it. Not that I was going down the wrong path or anything like that, but it actually opened up my eyes and my, my, my skills to an entirely separate um, craft. With McEwen University's art campus relocating to downtown, this is the second to last production in a long legacy at the Har Theatre. The new venue is going to be bittersweet and we love the old building, we love it, but it really is time to time to move forward. Audience members can see everything come together on February 3rd when Curtains takes the horror stage. In Edmonton, I'm Bianca Jade.